One, two, one, two, right? So kick hard, push the floor. This is gonna take your heart rate up fast. Now you're moving your body aggressively, right? Okay? Now you're gonna work. The footwork drill is good, but this one here, as soon as you stop, you're gonna feel it, all right? Attack each knee, escape two only. And immediately come back at them, escape two. Immediately attack each knee, escape two, no more. Escaping two, you wanna keep the pressure on them by not being too far away. Close enough that when you attack, if they don't move, it's gonna have to whack. Whack is right, all right? But don't get whack here, because you're gonna move. Are you understand? Yes, yes sir. Make your mark, good. Come in. Come in. Okay, push. sounds okay. good. Yeah. All right. Dance. 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 Yeah. Dance. Dance. Yeah. Throw Beachy. Go. Yeah. Go. Yeah. Go. 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 You hit her, she didn't go back. That's it. She didn't, there you go. Stay in the That's it. So remember that. Take two hammers again. Right? Stay in the The faster you stay, don't lean back. Don't lean back. Use that front leg. Go. Don't go anywhere. I say lean her off almost here. Closer. 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 If you lean down, if you lean down, you no longer can do this, right? You've got to hit the first step. You've got to push up there. If you lean back, and all of a sudden, you can't get back. Come on, back to straight lines. Come on, mean stop. Don't kick. You stop immediately. Okay? I still see people doing this. I'm going that way. I'm kicking and leaning this way. I'm going away from my opponent, my partner. I'm supposed to be going towards them. So you're not going to try to kick and get away at the same time. You're going to kick. So I'm going to try to reach him from here. I'm going. I'm not kicking out here either. I'm kicking here. This is where he is. So don't throw your leg out here. Trying to get there? Throw your kick for real. He sees it coming. I totally see it. Right, totally sees it. So. From here, my body has to come forward aggressively. All right, I'm coming forward, covering as much ground as I can. I land, my weight is here, now he comes forward. I don't do it again. Wait, 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 get back. Ready? You're gonna kick my hand from there. Bend those knees up. I didn't say come forward, I said kick my hand from there. Bend those knees right from there. No extra move, kick. Oh, that's the kick you should be doing. What was that other thing? Do it again, back up. Look how far you're going. No problem at all. Okay, so now I know you can do it, you're in trouble. Because I don't see you doing that. This is not working. I know you can do it. Once I know you can do something, I never let you go back. So if you kick from now on, you kick just like that. All right, nice and long, beautiful Michigi, that's what we do. So he's coming forward, long reach, landing here, then he escapes. Excellent. Let's see it one more time, a nice, long reach. When you're ready, on your own. She's up, let's go. Good stance. Okay. One back up, two, we're up. Ah, sit. As soon as you go on to attack her, back up for the kick. Back leg, it's always the back leg. One, right, and take off two. One, two, attack her. That's it. Oh, that's a good. That's a good. That makes you happy there, right? One, two. Come on, stop a second. Now, as soon as you land, you don't need to come all the way out. Keep going. So, you're landing, and you're almost anticipating what she's doing. You're waiting for her. Lean 
lean on towards her. So if you want to attack her again, your weight is going to be So if you land, land aggressively, instantly push hard to get away. Okay, no pause. Let's go. Push immediately. One, two, push. <laughs> That's a good. Push. Okay. So no, you fine. So there's no coming forward before you attack. As soon as you land, you push and attack. Escape. One, two. Push. No, getting the body going. Nice reach. Nice reach. Reach it all the way up. Yes. One, two, go. There. One, two, go. 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 Two. Oh. Oh. Hey. 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 No, 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 no. Hey. 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 Get the whole distance. 
You're not using that foot to sail, right? Yo, are you going to catch him? That's the one. Yeah! He's all the way through it. Big jump ahead. Yeah! I see how far he went. That's hard to get away. There you go. There you go. That's it. Yes! Well, I have more to get through. You need to jump in as well on this one. And make sure he's there. All right? Good. Good. Make sure you get to turn. Come on! Nice. That's nice. Come on. Stop. All right. Now, the push kick is coming up good. Now we're covering some distance. All right, gentlemen? Let's have a target over here. One of you doesn't matter who. Got a target? You're up. No, oh, you're up. Ready? By those knees? No, oh, you're kicking him. You're going to choose your partner. Now, watch this foot. Not the kicking one. Back up more. Back up more. There. Ready? Watch his left foot. Go. What does his left foot do? It was bouncing on the ground. It hopped through the air. All right, so for him to go that far, if his left foot doesn't move, he's going to land like this. And roll the thing. Okay, so his left foot is traveling underneath him. You guys know that you're doing it too? He's covering as much ground as he can. He's also not doing this first. He's going right from here, pushing. And one move, covering all that distance. That's what I want to see. One move to push that floor hard. Get going through the air, as much distance as you can get. Okay, so maximum explosive power yeah. off that back leg. Let's try this, let's go. Back to what you guys are doing. Let's see it. All right, here it is. Sorry, in front of you, Bobby. Good, not in front of you, Bobby. Off the side, if he misses, he might not. Okay, defense, keep the water, and push the floor from there. Oh, yeah. Come on, you got this. Bend those knees. That's better. Go for it. One more. Bend those knees. Go for it. Good. 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 Nice hop on the back leg. There. Look at those down. That's it. So the more that leg comes up, the less of that drag. But look, you were you were right here. The more you were saying, okay, I can do it here. Right? Look where you did it. Look at this. That's pretty far, right? Try it again. Drive forward. Bring that leg up. Oh, don't you walk in. You're got you're on this red, right? Oh, we did a drive forward. Don't worry about hitting the hand. Remember with the back leg. Back leg. Good. That's right. Really, right? Don't worry about hitting the hand. If you hit the hand, it's great. The biggest thing is seeing ah, how far out of the head. All right, keep the head up. Right? The, the head goes down, the body goes down. All right, so keep that head up. Good stand. Drive it. Go. That's Watch that little hop at the beginning, though. You, you, right? Right here. Get your knee. Push. Push. Here. I want you to here. Right. Drive the knee. Go. Try that knee. Oh, there, look at that, that's it. The hand is just right there. It's like right there. But that, the thing is that. Easy. Push. That one. Yes. Like that. See? Right. That's it. That's All it. Right. What do we got? What's this distance? What's this distance? Now drive that. Oh, no. good. 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 Let that hit the knee get out ahead of your weight. Let this one keep moving with you. Right? So there you go. Keep this one underneath you the whole time. So don't go so far that you end up like this. This one is gonna move underneath your body. There you go. The whole time. So think about the leg you're standing on. This one here. Think about that one more than the one that's kicking. Push through. There. That's good. One more. Or now, last thing, pull my hand, pull my other hand, put your back knee on my chest. Lift, that's it, now push, there, now look at me higher. Sit now, relax, grip your knees on your chest. There you go. There, so there's where I want your knee in the air. See where it is, way up high? That's move number one. Before you even kick, that's where your knee's going to be in the air. Okay? All right. Here we go. So knee in the air in front of you, the most important thing. Yes. Don't worry about the kick. Even if all you do is this. That's it. That's okay. Just a little bit closer. Hitting the hands now is as important as. Up in here. Right there. Knee up, move number one. There you go. Look at that. That's the kick. Excellent. There you go. Come on. Now. Push kick is looking good. You're starting to understand how far you can travel 
If you push the floor hard, you can go for it. Now we're doing the drill we did a minute ago. Where you did beach and your partner escaped. Now you're attacking them with push -down. So you might have to skate more than twice. Okay, so from here, good, funny sense. I'm attacking her with push kick. She's gonna take off. She's gonna back up down the floor. And then she throws push kick. That's it. Get and push. That's a key yeah. part. Right? Get that knee up. Right? Now remember, don't just lift it. Jump back with the hip before you get ready. Jump. There, right? One more time. Sorry. Back leg, jump at me high. That's better. Right? Jumping. Jump. Right. Right, push right away. Good. Okay, that's it. She's landing hard, and then she has to back off that leg immediately. Nice work, okay? You might have to skate more than twice. And as soon as you land, you better be thinking about getting out of there, or there's no time. If they've gone back a couple times, they're coming back at you, you do this, you're gonna hit. Okay, good work. All right, that's it. Back leg push kick. There's no stance. No, no. Funny stance. Funny stance. You're trying to push kick at him, he's escaping too. Then you escape when he comes at you. Big push kick in the air, grab him. No, 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 what is that? Okay, bend those knees. The same drill right from here. Fly him with his back leg. It's like he has a hand up. Okay, he has his hand up, but he's not going after that one. Push kick. Good, then escape twice, he comes at you with push kick. No, not our front leg. What leg? The back leg. Get closer, get closer, get closer, get closer. Here he comes. One, you didn't move. Get out of there. Get out of there. That's it. Now go after him with that leg. Push kick. Good. Here he comes. Get out of there. That's it. Go after him immediately. Push kick. No, back leg. This one. All right. This one. All right. Let's go. That's it. Right back, right? Ah, there we go. Good. Now you do the same thing. She's backing up so she doesn't land on your foot. There we go. Knee to your chest. Knee to that chest. There it is. Ah, that's good. That's where you should be. Is it again? Ready? Good. Ready? Change up. That's enough. Change up for the next two. Ready? See it.
Are you body packing for Jazz today? understand how much you have to escape sometimes as something's coming at you. So it just lets you know yeah, how you can get caught. Like sometimes it's hard and you're not ready to move. You can realize real quick, wow, if you really push the floor, you can run them down. Inspiring is one that you have to go against your instinct. Go against what comes naturally. So in Taekwondo, you train yourself to react to certain situations. Okay, in this case, someone's attacking you. They're throwing a kick at you. And typically, when someone throws a kick at you, what's the first thing you're going to do? I'm going to hit you. Right, where you I'm going to kick at you right now. I'm going to hit you. Don't let me hit you. Exactly. He's going to get to safety. People got to go away. That's a natural thing to do. There's danger. He just moved away from the danger. You back him. That's typically what your brain will make you do. In a lot of our sparring, that's what we do. Now, you're going to do the opposite. Instead of moving away from the danger, you're going to go right at it as hard as you can. So instead of moving away when someone attacks you, you're going at them aggressively. All right? You're just going to drive right in, hard and fast, and shut them down. So we're going to work on how to use punching as a counterattack to an aggressive opponent. And someone who's really aggressive to attack hard, moving at them is the best strategy. It sucks their energy down, it's very humiliating and frustrating for them. They think they've got you backed up, and suddenly you're right on them and hitting them. Extremely annoying. You hear me say that a lot when you're sparring, be as annoying as you possibly can to the other person. Right? Get in their head, frustrate them, don't let them do what they want to do. Right? So if it's someone who likes to attack, they always want to attack you, the best thing to do against an attacker is attack them. They're in a frame of mind where they want to come forward after you, not back off. So if you've got someone who always wants to come forward, go at them the whole time, force them out of their game. So punching when they come at you is one of the ways you're going to do that. So we're going to start off first with a simple footwork drill, just to make sure you're using the right foot and you do this. And then we'll get into the punching. So shields can put aside just for now. Face your partners. Get. Come in. Come in. Ah! All 
All right, so all we're going to do from here is very simple. This is my partner right here. He just stands, he's not going to go anywhere. Okay, I'm going to step my front foot towards him. My front one always, not my back one. So from here, I'm going to step like this. And then I'm going to move away. And he's going to do the same thing to me. Your front foot only is going to step. Step in, one, and he moves back. Perfect. That's my job. That's the only job I have is to make sure my front foot moves in and I go back. And he does it to me. Front foot only. Front foot steps towards me and he backs up. That's the move. Seems very simple, but if you don't have that simple movement down, the punching is going to become difficult. So your job back and forth is I'm with my partner right here. Ready? Eyes on me. I go one, step, and move away. He comes towards me. Step and goes away. Step and away. Step and away. Just like that. Front foot steps and I push with the back. Step the sides, then step away. Front foot steps in, back foot can step away. Back and forth, very simple. That is your job. Nothing else. Don't add anything to it. Keep it as simple as you can. Understand? Yes, sir. All right, let's go. Practicing on your own. Back and forth. Oh wait, back again. Down. So with this one here. Okay, keep close. Get nice and close. Keep close. Not this. Okay. From here, my front foot only. My front foot does the step. That's it. Now your back foot is going to travel with you. So watch my feet. Ready? One, two. Push. Step. So I push this one here. My back foot stays dug in my stance right there. All right, careful. careful with this. Okay, lean on it. Okay, bounce a couple times. There, that's where your feet need to be. Now from here, your move is that front foot steps only. That's it. One. Then push back. Okay, then you go. That's it. Right, and that's it. Now, so you have to be able, okay, to not fly like this. Okay, you didn't cry before, you didn't cry here. Okay. Okay, yeah. So I can see you get that stance in that. I want you to break that stance. And from here, really lean on the front leg. Bounce a couple times to your back foot. I can pick my right, I can pick my back foot right off the ground when I'm doing this. Now, keep that position and step your front very aggressively. So you're leaning on it and you lift it up and step it forward. There, that's the move, right? It forces the back foot to come whether you want it to or not. That's the move. Then you can hop back. Okay, lean on the front leg. Step the front. Good. Okay, one more time. So not both feet this time. The front literally lifts up. There, right. That, right. Front foot lifts. So think about from here. My front foot has to get to that line. Okay. So from here, I have to step my front foot across the line. Only. There, right? Your back foot pulls whether you want it to or not. Okay, if you back up, then you're going to step your front foot only. Hey, big bird. Yeah, Hey. Hey. Come on. Eyes here for a minute. Now, this stepping motion, what leg goes? What steps? The front leg goes first. The front leg. So it's not this. I'm leaning on my front leg. My back foot, I can pick right off the ground. My weight is on this one. This one here, I have to step my front foot only to that red and blue line. That's my move. From here, I do this. Now, what's wrong with my stance though? What's wrong with the stance? I'm in big trouble. I can't do anything from here other than block if I'm lucky. This one's gonna move with it, but Okay, from here I'm leaning forward, I step my front leg where I need it to go. Now my back foot slides, even my stance. But this one steps in. Now I'm closer, I back my stance. But it's the front leg that's going to step. So I'm literally going to pick that front leg up and step it without moving the back foot until that foot's on its way down. So it steps, then my back foot travels. But it's the front one. Okay, I need the front one only to go towards him. Then my back foot slides in behind immediately. But step the front leg towards the person. Let's go. Let's see it again. Great stance. Okay, who's going? All right, I need to put your opponent. Okay, show me the front leg only. I can't move this. Yes. Fight. Uh, one. Like this one. Right? Okay, then the knees. Push 
off. Peter Park, Peter Park. That's nice. Get it off. Get those knees. Get it off. That's part four. And the back of the slide action. Step over this one only. That's it, the back leg travels, then take off. Ready, lean on this one. Step over my foot. Ah, no more time for you. Don't move your back one, only your front. There, then back, and let your back foot come in, then back up you go. Back foot automatically. This one only. And let the back, all right, very aggressive, ready? Very aggressive, step over. That's it, very aggressive, step over. There we go, now you get the idea. Let your body drag nice, that, that foot. Nice, that was good. That was good front work. Show me. There you go. Use your stance. Front foot go. Good. Back up. Nice. Okay, you're the same thing as far as you're going. Okay, all you're doing is you're lifting that foot. Just push it forward. Good. And this back leg is nice and loose, right? It's just like a... Nice. Oh, I didn't do anything. Back to the street. And then when you're going backwards, then you're going backwards. Number one. Just the back one. The other one just comes with it. Uh, you step forward. Four. You step back. Wow. It just automatically wow. comes forward. Ready? And go. Just lift it up. Just lift it up. There. And just think of it. Just nice and There. And then go. So don't move the front one. Don't move the front one. Go backwards. Don't move the front one. Oh, look at that. Good. Are you there. There you go. Good. Ready? Come on. Nice. Come on. All right. Eyes here. Eyes here. Now, when you're punching, doesn't matter if it's your front hand or your back hand, that is the exact same move for both. Stand there. Just give me a target. If I'm punching my front hand, you know move? This foot steps. If I'm punching my back hand, this foot steps. My stance does not change. I do not do this. I keep this hip way back here, as far away as I can. This is my front hand. This hip is way back here. Why? Why well, want my hip way back here? So if you're push, you don't fall back. Yeah, I've got my balance. What else can I do when my hip is way back here? Kick. Kick with full power. If I step this forward, my hip is already turned, I've lost that back leg power. I always want the back leg power. So I step in here, one, my hip, if I need it, I can kick full power, same with the back hand. One, I've got all the power on the back leg. So it doesn't matter if it's front or back. My job to move towards them is step that front foot. Even if you don't punch, if you're gonna attack someone coming at you, the most important part of this drill, remember this, I'm gonna ask you, is to move forward when they come at you. All right, so when they attack the or beach gi, the most important thing is that. Their foot ends up way out here. Okay, so right from here, he's throwing e down at my stomach. Skip the front leg. Oh, you know what? Let's go, kick. Okay. Kick. Thank you. All right, so from here, bend those knees. He's aiming right here, go. Oh, nice, all right, back up. Okay, watch. Oh, now it's not as fun. Watch. So his body's moving forward. We have this much distance. He's calculated how hard he has to push.
to get to here. So he attacks. Nice, the body comes forward. So when he's coming in, he has a certain amount of time he's gonna take, he's prepped to get to here. He attacks again. What happened? See how far away his foot was? All I did was this. And he missed me by that much. Because I moved towards him, and all that time, any distance he put into getting to me, no longer counts. I moved close, okay, cut the time and distance, and his foot was way behind me. And now I'm right here on him. And now you're in trouble. Okay. <laughs> so, on this drill here, watch. Okay. My front hand, I don't have to swing it. I can put it right against my body and leave it here. Okay. He throws E down. I step in and he runs right into this. I don't have to swing it. He's right there. And the reason I don't want to have it too extended is when I hit here, okay, what am I really doing with my hand right now? Okay. What am I really doing with my hand? Yes? You're punching. I'm, I'm punching, but what am I doing here? What am I controlling? Your control. Distance. What can I do with this distance? What can I do to you? I don't want to escape. I can get right under my own arm. So he comes flying in again. He's expecting this beautiful e hand right here. He goes for it. I step in and hit him, and I stopped him this far away from me, and I can kick under my own arm. Very simple, very straightforward. Now, strong stance, strong stance. Now, I don't want to hit him here, and those knees, because if I try to push him over, don't let me. I can't do it, he's strong. Okay, now, with my finger. Ready, strong stance, ready? That's right, <laughs> My finger can push him over, because instead of pushing this way where he's strong, I'm hitting him here and he can't stand up, all right? So, I step in, I hit him right here, bang. And I've got, he's off balance now, and I can kick to the stomach. So, the drill is this. He throws e Dan at me, I step in, and put my fist right on his chest, and just kick to the stomach, and come back, that's it. I do three or four, he does three or four, we change our stance, and repeat. Everybody understand? Yes, sir. All right, let's give this a try. Over here, the shield is your chest. Okay, let's go. Fighting stance. Fighting stance, left foot in front. Okay, so he's trying to Okay, sure thing. All right, so I look here. I look here. I look here. I Thank <laughs> you. 
Now the instep is hitting. It goes from there. That's it. Four or five each, and then next person goes. Let's go. So now, I'm going to get the same position. All right. That's it. Nice. I get it. See, with that front leg, you just get it. I'm going to try it. Don't do this. Okay, good. Your leg is high. You can get here on her. 
Roll it right across the heart. Don't be so nice, you can take it. <laughs> 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 Good. Take it sideways, this, and they'll go, ah, and while they're going, ah, what are you doing? <laughs> Landing about four points on them, right, before the referee can say anything. So you step in aggressive. In the clinch, it's going to be ugly, dirty, very physical, it's not pretty. Win it. All right, so when you go in, you go in aggressive, sideways, get right in there on them. Okay, so now, this time, we're going to work the reverse punch, which is a lot more power. So the last one from here, fighting stance, like, okay? So from here, he was using his front leg. He's attacking me with his front leg. I'm stepping in with my front hand and scoring with my front leg. Now, back leg, back hand, back leg. So this time, he's coming forward. He's kicking me in the kidney, my back, with B cheeky. Oh, nice, I like this guy kicks, good. Okay, that's all back, kick. Kick hard. Okay. Uh, right, like that. Go back. Good. But now he's moving aggressively. Change. Watch what happens to his body, his body path. Right now, it's facing that way. When he throws BGD, watch it. See how it turns? It's on this side. Okay, go back. So what I have to do, my front foot steps towards him, I'm going to catch him in the middle of that turn with this hand. So from here, he throws BGD. Right in the middle of his kick, I've stepped in, and I'm catching him right in the chest. Okay, can you for a second? So I hit him just like this, hard. And now, I've kept this back leg way back here. All right, so if this foot's coming down, depending on your leg length, okay, you can cut, or if you have to, you do a little switching cut to get in the distance. But the idea again, change. He comes, change. He comes forward, beat your knee. I step in, his foot's gonna miss. Even though I didn't punch, I still closed the gap. I'm right here now. So same foot steps in. Thank you. Okay, I'm feeling sweaty there. I appreciate that. All right, good. So step forward. Just put the hands right there. Leave it there. And if you're real close, you switch. Just in one motion, you kick. Reverse punch now against the back leg, kicking at your back. Let's try it. Sorry if I heard you. I'll be okay. Better care. Okay. All right. Ready? Let's go. So now it's BGE. Body stance. Okay. Body stance. Now you're coming forward like this. Just a big step forward like BGE. Okay, show you a big step. Nice. Right? That's good. Do it again. So when he does that, you keep your stance. Hop in. Punch this hand. And that shield. Right? 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 And do this, but don't step your back foot. Always this one. Ready? Three. Big step forward. Now, cut. Back leg. Power leg. Yes, that's it. Good. Okay, one more time. Now, you step. Big yellow. 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 Big Good. Hey! 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 Hey!
you, Michael. Yeah. You're a star. You're on TV. And also you. Am I on TV? Oh, there I am. I saw Michael Hemmings working there a few minutes ago. Thor. He was on there, so. You're Thor? a big company. Yeah. yeah. Can you do this? Uh, 
don't expect to get it all the first time you're trying it. But just pick up on the concept of going at someone, stopping them, and then going away. No, That's all we're doing. So, Mr. Meet yes, Mr. Juggy the Jugger. So, Mr. Juggy the Jugger? Yeah, because you drink out of there. So it's one move to do this. So I'm catching your leg, blocking, and then going to work. Alright? And those that are really effective, the second they block, they roll their hand. Actually, for a millisecond, lift up on your leg. No, you're not. That's why I say if you're good and fast. You didn't hear that from me. But if it does this to you, you're really in trouble then. Because as soon as they lift your leg, you're done, right? So the, the real move is with the front hand, it's this. I can see in. So I'm catching your leg to block. So even your knee's not going to hit me, I'm stopping you. Or the other one is this. And you keep this with books. So if it's the back hand, this one stays not to stay in front of your body like this. And it's just enough, and right there. That's it, right. So if you're punching this one, that's it, right there. So if I was kicking you in the back here, you're hitting me in the chest at the same time, and if you turn your hand and lift a little bit, oh, <laughs> just don't get caught. <laughs> and if it's the front hand, okay? okay, so if I'm kicking front leg at you, keep this one up here. This one goes to my chest, that one goes to my leg. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Natural cheat. That's good. Alright, last two runners. Shields off the side, you're not going to need them for this. You're not picking this side. Good. So put the ring out way where you can't step on Alright, so the last drill, you move towards someone coming at you. Things went well, you managed to punch. Kick, score a point. Things don't always go well. Sometimes you'll just end up right next to them in the clinch. And that's absolutely fine. When you're in that clinch, you stay there. The one thing I do not want to ever see you do sparring, when you're clinching against my hands right here, okay, I get in the clinch right here, I don't want to see this. Because the second he feels me moving away, what's he going to do? Punch. Punch, all he has to do is kick, all he has to do is cut his back leg. As soon as he feels me starting to move away, he kicks right now. Boom, I walk right into it. The easiest point he'll ever get. Whose fault was that? His or mine? It's my fault. I gave it to him. Right, it's a gift. We get in the clinch here, I'm pushing against him, I don't like it. Oh, I don't want to be there. Bang, two points. Easiest he'll ever get. My fault. Because I wasn't disciplined, I wasn't patient. Right? Getting close to someone, they make that mistake, not you. You stay in there, make it annoying on them. We get that clinch in here, punch him a couple times, move around a little bit, make it annoying. He doesn't like it, he starts to move away. Boom! And I'm gonna score. So stay in there, the referee will break you up eventually, but don't lose your focus and pull away because you think you have to keep the action going. You don't. That's not your job. Your job is to keep them from scoring on you. Keep them from doing what they want. So eight. Alright? Eight. We'll go with eight. So when we get the clinch. We're going to work on a move that's going to make it a little more comfortable and improve your confidence when you're in there. You're going to get behind the person. You're going to do a little move to get behind them and put them in a bad position. All right, so it's going to look like this. Come here. All right, if I can stand my leg in front. So, pop right in and clinch me. Boom. We get in here. Now, as soon as we're in the clinch, I want to be behind him. If I get out here, there's all kinds of things he can do to me. I get behind him, much more difficult for him. So, from here, Okay, we're in the clinch. My back hand, when it's behind him, is going to go on his back low, right above his hip, right on his kidney. My other one is up here for the referee to see. I'm not holding. Right? My hand's up here. My back leg is going to step behind his front leg, right here. And if I'm really greasy, I can do this too. Oh, look, I'm bending his knee, but I'm not. Okay, so step behind him. Now, my hand is still on his back. My leg is behind him. I'm going to take this leg and pivot behind him for power. So I can kick hard. Okay? So as soon as you get in the clinch again, he clinches me. One, my hand goes on his lower back. My back leg steps behind him, and I rotate right here. Not out here. He's gone. I stay nice and close, right here. Now, if he tries to kick me, 
Pick me. Pick me. He can't. All I do is this. Then his hips bend and he falls over. All right, so I've got control of him for a moment or two until A, either the referee catches on that I'm pushing him too much here or he gets out of there. Okay, so it's clinch, hand, step, open, bang. Right to the stomach right away. Okay, and then you move whatever you want to say. You double it up too. Ah, ah. Okay, so let's work on that. Let's give it a try. Right. Let's go. With your partners. That's okay. Right. Fighting oh, stance right here. Fighting stance. Fighting stance. Fighting change. First thing, clinch. Get it. Clinch. Ah, so just keep those things. Put your feet. You're going right. to move. This hand goes on the back. Step behind with this one. Your hands in here. Then rotate all the way open. You can pick up from there. Good. All right, do that again. Stand. Three arms are down there. Good. Now, hand. Don't move yet. Not yet. Closer. Closer. Move right against them. Hand. Step behind them. Pivot. Good. There we go. All right, your turn. All the way back. Yes. Now, let me Clinch. Back hand goes on his back. This foot steps behind his leg. Then step open. And come. No. This is what This is what This is what This is what This is This Oh, and boom. Step behind this front leg. Right to him. Right. Spin around. Ah. Your left leg. And come back with it. All right. So, more time. That's the move. All right. That's how we Clinch. Now, wait, wait. Stop now, when you clinch someone, okay, watch here. All right. So, right here. Keep clinching. Don't go by them. You don't have to protect your chest. You clinch someone, you're going to lock. Right against them. She clinches me here. That can take a lot. It's annoying. Right there. Of course, it's going to be ugly. It's not this beautiful kick and kick. This right, you can get right in there and don't. If you go here, you're walking right into this, okay? So I want to stay where I can get behind her front leg. So as soon as you get in here, I need to stay on this side of her. And then, hand is here, step behind her leg. Now she doesn't do anything. Anything. Okay, you get nothing. Okay, I'm behind you. Now for higher belts, it's a really flexible. She picked this front leg up. Hook there, heel right in my chin. You gotta watch that. Right now, you don't. There! <laughs> but for now, it's just in here again. Clinch, aggressive. Now, Hand, step, bring this hip way back, and then bring it in right again. Let's go. Get in there, just clinch up close, close. That's it. Hands up. Hand on her kidney. Kidney, step behind her. Get it. Pull it more. And then, bang, there it is. Good. 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 Step, open, step, open. Right, step, open. Right, she's back. Right, 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 right,
One line right here. Like this right here. Step behind right here. Right Right in behind her. Look at this. Now I got her. Look at that. See where that knee is now? Look. Look at her body. Today. She doesn't like that right there, right? Then I step around. Good. All right. Let's go. Clinch first. Clinch. One. You hear her hand on her top to break it down. Then she clenches it. Push it. Boom. Like that. We're clenched, right? We're clenched right here. I step in behind. Step in behind. Right, so I'm right, in behind, right in behind here. Now I've got control. I step up. That step out behind. That step in behind is critical. Step in behind. There. Right. So you step in here. That's all it takes. Step behind. One. There. You're trying to do this. We were trying to do this. All of those. So rotate it through. All right. So. One. Over. Over. Now. Your shoulder. Step behind is the first part. Number two step. We have to make there. Even more. You need to step behind even more. On that, that second step. That second step. Go right in behind her. Take her back. Right here. Come here. What are you doing here? Don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about this until this one is in position right here. Because now I'm in behind. Now I'm behind it where you want you to. So I do the more if I go here, we're going to clutch right here. We're going to right here. I only go right here to say I want to step right here. Right? Now, when I step back, see what's happening to the more hand. I'm still aligned with her. She can still get me. Right? But if we're here, and I step behind, oh, you got to come a long ways around before she's got to come. Oh, I'm, all, I'm still here. She's got to come all the way around for me. That's what you have to do. I don't want to see that. Pay attention. I'll clench it. Step. There you go. Come on. There you go. Come on. Eyes here. All right, nice work over here, standing over here. All right, you guys are coming in. One thing they started working over there a little bit is using the shoulder when they get in that clinch. All right, so we're right here. He clinches me right in. One, now, hit me with the shoulder even this time. Not sitting hard with the shoulder. Oh! All right, he's hitting me here. While he's hitting me pushing, he's doing this move behind me. There you go. Step, I'll be all right. Nice. All right, so that little shoulder is just annoying me. Meantime, he's stepping behind, switches, he hits me before I know what's going on. All right, you guys all have that? That's well done. All right. Last thing I want to do is to wrap things up here. Okay. We're going to reverse that move on the person doing it to you. So they're going to come in, they're going to try to get behind you. The second they try to, you're going to reverse it, and they're going to end up in the same position you were a second ago. So when they start to do that move on you, suddenly switch, switch, and they end up in the same position they thought they had you in just a second ago. All right, so it's gonna look like this. Over here, so, so watch. So from here, we get getting the clinch. One, he starts to make this move. Behind me, he starts to come around. As he gets here, I'm gonna change my stance at him, aggressively. Now, be careful when you do this in class. If you're at a tournament though, watch this knee, okay? So as I switch towards him, watch what this knee does. See where it is? It's buried in his thigh. All right, so in clinch work, you're gonna get banged up, charity horse, there's a lot of this. But I switch at him, not out here. I'm trying to get behind him with the switch. Now, we're in the clinch again. The same way we were a second one, the other leg. I step behind him, boom, and put him here, and I've also got his arm at the same time, right? So, one more time, starts off exactly the same. We clinch, on, he starts to make this move, I switch towards him. And as I switch, I step, and I end up in the position I want him at, okay? Right away. So, the second they go to make that move on you, you change your hands in one motion, then you do the move on them on the other side. That's it. Try it on your own, okay? Let's see it. Basically, you show him the air and clinch, and then you do a control. Then you switch. So you step. Two. One, go. You need to switch hard only two. Don't jump, jump forward. Forward. Jump forward. From there, he's going to show. Back here, right here. Right? Just stay nice and close. Right? Right here. 
try this one. Hey, thank you. This one looks great. Right here next. Right. And don't you start. You start there. Now look where you are. You're in the clinch, so you step over. Yeah. Step I step am right now. Step in. Now, yeah. now you got the position. Now, yeah. yeah. the position that she wanted, you, you took her. away from her. What? Then you step away from her. It's when she when she's here, you can have her clinches in. She clinches in right here. Boom. Like that. She steps. She steps behind. Says the minute she starts stepping in, I'm going back into the clinch. We're back into the clinch again. Right? I step down. Bam! Oh, look at her. Look at this. So in order for her to kick me now, now, Instructor Glenn has a good front hook kick that you can probably use by putting my hand in order to protect myself here. But in order for her to kick here, she has to turn. While she's turning, just start turning. Try and make sure make move. I'm going to kick her right to the face. Right? So the biggest thing is when you're doing it, let you guys go up. Again, when you clench, when she steps, oh, look at that. We're back into the clench. Yeah, I'm back right where we started. Then I reverse it. Step behind them? Right away. <laughs> 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 That's what I'm like, Whoa. So step, switch the feet. There, now you do it. Step behind. Step right behind her. Get behind her. That's it, right? So when you're here, after you, that's it. Because when you, if you step, when you're here, if you step back here and then over here, you do this right, right? You don't do this. We'll be here until three o'clock. Fighting stance. Fighting stance. Clinch. Clinch. Good. She's starting to reverse. Now step behind her. Now go out. Now look at look at this. Now. There you go. Same move you've always done. Step behind her. Switch right away. There, step behind. Don't forget. Aggressive with that hand on the kidney. And that clinch, where the clinch right here. Okay. She starts to make the move on me. One. So not only make right here, right here, and right here, and 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 <laughs> That's better. Good. Come on. Come on. Face your partners. Face your partners. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You good? Sir. Okay. Everyone line back up. One straight line the way you were in class starters. All the way down here. And face this way. One straight line. Good. Yes, sir. And I'm Joe. Have a seat. Have a seat, cross your legs. Eyes this way. Good. Legs crossed. Sitting up properly. And we got a body pad on. It's not easy.